Yeah, my screen is recording. Okay. Uh, did not make a full refund. Emirates canceled tickets and did not propose anything on how to fly and did not make a full refund. If you use Emirates, you can stay without you can stay without a ticket and without money. I had two tickets for this flight on on th- July 13th. On for, uh, on the 4th of July, I was informed that Emirates had canceled the flight. I contacted Emirates customer services and asked about any alternative flight, and they answered that they could not do it. They proposed later at their flights on on July 16th. But it was impossible for us because we had visas valid until July 14th. So I told them about it. So they suggested requesting a, a refund. And pos- I did it. But they refunded a small percentage of ticket costs. I had two. two boys, like 800 USD. What? 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 The Emirates is for such a cancel. Turkish Air. What? what? No, look, I'm not break this. So look. Okay, shut up. Shut up. Okay. Shut up. Shut up. We're sitting in the airport. First and hugest disappointment and shock happened when I opened application to add some information and found out that some of my family's return tickets were changed 10 days ago without notifying any of my family by members by email or text or call. We got a quarter according to new tickets that we had to stay in Dubai for almost three days for connecting flight. Oh. And I discovered that, that by chance. When I, when I called the agent to fix this problem, she told me that I had to pay $1,000 extra because they didn't have the same class tickets. While it was not my choice to change travel dates, I had to go in person to go ticketing to solve the, the problem with the agent. With re, re, return tickets date to be able to come back, back to work in time after vacation. Beca- vacation. Nice spelling right there, actually. The, the ticketing agent said that I'd... That to be able to return on the day, that day I have to stay in Dubai for 25 hours while well, initial reservation it was 17 hours. Wow. I asked about a complimentary hotel and she tried she tried but failed to book it in the system and offered to do it later. On my way back to the USA in Dubai Emirates desk, refused to give us a free hotel and we had to spend 25 hours sitting in the herp, in the airport. Oh my God. Wow. Wow. Like 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 why? Like wow. Southwest time. Okay, fine. Southwest. This is gonna be a. This is. Shit. Wow. Southwest. (laughs) Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. This we. This video might need a part two actually. Nine out of ten. The flights have been delayed. Uh, Nine out of ten. Had zero sense of urgency, late for no reason, kept changing the departure time, and never told us what was going, to go, was going on or why. After boarding, we just sat there for 30 minutes. No announcement. Nothing. Baggage staff took their sweet time putting, putting the bags under the plane. Had zero sense of urgency. I had an appointment that I had over an hour and, and a half of leeway to get to. Thanks. I missed it. I will never fly this airline again. Oh, well, that concludes this video for now.